Hey guys, in this video, I'll be showing you how you can create flashcards. Now you can create flashcards for your class if you're a teacher, or if you are selling it, you can create those flashcards here in Canva. So the type of flashcards that I'll be creating today is a type where you can either sell it, or if you're a teacher for elementary school, then you could try to create these and use them with your students. So our flashcard size is three by five inches. So to create the flashcard, I'm going to go here to create a design. Then I'm going to custom dimensions and I'm going to type in the three by five inches. So first I need to change this PX here to inch, then type in the measurement. So that's three by five. Next, I click create new design. So basically we'll have a template coming up here that has the dimensions that I just punched in. So here we go. So as I was saying guys, you can create a flashcard for just about anything here in Canva, making use of features such as elements, text and so forth. So for these flashcards, we'll just be creating flashcards for different animals. So I'm going to create five of them. So to start off, I'm going to go to elements and search for a particular animal. The first one will be dog, very simple. So I just need an image of a dog and I'll be just using these cartoon like images, these 2D images. So I'm going to just scroll down, see what's here. So I'm going to choose this one, this Dalmatian looking one. Or you know what, let me change that and go for this one here. So depending on which one you click on guys, as you see here, you're, you're free to change the color of the dog that you have there. These are flashcards for like naming or identifying different animals. So here we have the dog. And then I'm going to press T on my keyboard because I need to add some text to this. So this first one is almost done. So let me just go in and see if I want to change the color. Okay, I think I'll leave it at that. So we have a dog right there. So moving on to the next one, I just clicked add page to go on to a new page. So now I'm going to search for mouse. So here we have one here. So now let me add some text. All right, so that's done. Next, we're going to do a cat. So let me type that in. So as I was saying guys, basically you can come to your elements and you should be able to find a wide variety of different elements to use for your different flashcards that you want to create. I'm going to work with this one here. Again, this one provides you with the option to change colors. Not all of them you'll be able to change colors, but some do allow you to change colors. I'm gonna let this color remain. So let me add the name of this animal here. 
so cute. So at this point, again, you can choose whether or not you want to change the color of your background, whether you want to change the color of the text that you're using and so forth. Next, I'm going to type in bird. I'm gonna work with this this okay I'm seeing a few that I've wanted to use right now all right let me come back up so I'm going to use this one So we have bird. Uh, what next? Which other animal should I do? Um. All right. Let's let me do a lion. All right. I think I'm gonna just do a bear rather than a lion. I need a good beer. Alright, I'll just do this dancing beer. So there you have it guys. So these are just some flashcards you can use if you are, as I said, a kindergarten or elementary school teacher. You can create these in Canva, print them out and have them to use with your students. Or if you're actually selling flashcards online, then there are free images in here that you can make use of in creating your flashcards and so forth. So that's it for today guys. I hope you found this video useful. Feel free to ask any questions you may have and I'll respond to you. So until my next video, I'll talk to you then. Goodbye.